Jessica. She's a stakeholder relations manager for Acme Corp. Jessica knows that proper planning will help her minimize oversights, eliminate duplicated efforts, and simplify her reporting process. That's why she uses engagement plans to provide a real-time view of her team's progress as a project or campaign unfolds and to quickly adjust course as needed. Put simply, creating an engagement plan allows Jessica to structure the huge amount of data collected over the course of her project. Think of it as a bucket where she would put all of the stakeholders, communications, issues, and commitments, which would then help her extract valuable information to empower her team to make informed decisions. What's even better is that it can evolve as you use it. Jessica needs to run a media campaign. Her team will contact journalists to present them with a press release, gather information from the press review, and collect information from social media that mentions their organization. To keep track of these activities, Jessica created an engagement plan called Media Tracking and Outreach. Linking all the related communications to the engagement plan allows her to identify key themes, stakeholders, messages, and issues that arise, measure community sentiment by separately identifying positive and negative articles, create a concise record of all media activity during a certain time frame, determine which media activities generate the most engagement, and evaluate community response. Engagement plans aren't just useful for media campaigns, they're practical for all kinds of projects. When Jessica works on an infrastructure project, her engagement plan allows her to quickly add stakeholders within range of a certain asset to the plan, and to enter or access tasks, engagements, and communications from her mobile app while she's working in the field. As part of the infrastructure project, Jessica needs to contact 1,058 businesses that will be impacted by a light rail construction project. She has a large team and they'll need to manage a lot of stakeholders. To help monitor her team's progress and make sure all the businesses are contacted in time, Jessica will use an engagement plan as a project management tool. First, she'll set up an activity in Borealis to contact all the businesses. The activity will automatically create a template task that explains how to contact each organization and what information to provide. As tasks are completed and closed, Jessica can easily evaluate the situation to make sure project deadlines are met. Since the system generates the tasks that need to be done, Jessica's team can focus on the quality of their interactions instead of scrambling to find out what to do next. Using engagement plans to their full potential provides great strategic value for organizations that want to adhere to stakeholder engagement best practices, create recurring activities, and be more proactive in their engagements. For Jessica, this requires three additional steps. By including a SWOT analysis, Jessica and her external affairs director can be sure that they identify where to engage or invest resources to achieve the best outcomes. Setting objectives and milestones will help Jessica plan more effectively. Objectives can keep the public involvement team focused and make sure they understand when and how they will achieve their main priorities. Milestones can help Jessica recognize if things start to go off track so she can quickly reassess her strategy. Finally, proactively reflecting on a project's successes and failures will allow Jessica to incorporate what she and her team have learned in their future engagement activities. This ensures that her processes and plans will continually improve. Do you feel ready to start using engagement plans or want to move up a level? Contact us today to be part of the future of stakeholder engagement.